Hi, my name is Kafri Danku. Keep watching the African Drum channel and subscribe. Hi guys, my name is Ayin Anwigwe. I'm an actor and you're watching the African Drum channel on YouTube. Make sure you subscribe guys. This is full entertainment content. We have the beautiful Stacy out here. Um, we just finished the press um, listening of um, Becca and Trigmatic. That's I'm Love and Friend. Beautiful song. I think it's going to make, um, it's going to top the charts for a long time. But the MC for the night was one and only Stacy. If you don't know Stacy, go find out who Stacy be. Stacy, how are you, my dear? I'm good, Yemi. How are you too? Nice one, nice one. And, um, you know, um, you've been in the news lately, but tell us a little bit how far restoration has been from the point it started to the time it gained uh, weight and um, how far it's still running. Restoration has done awesome from our very first episode, which was with Hawa Abubakar, the Ghanaian Finnish model. Mm. It did very well. I would say God has blessed us enough that we started making the tabloids with our very first episode. Our second episode was with Nana Mama Brown, where right. she opened up and spoke about prior theater. Yeah. That one also hits the media, and the media started carrying stories. And from that episode, Thankfully to God, every week we do hit the tabloids with the people and the topics we treat. Huh. The one that got my attention. <laughs> <laughs> There's no way we are not going to talk about that yeah, one, Baba. Because, because I did a video about it, you know, talking about it mm -hmm. as well. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, you know, because I know you have you owe the copyright to your original content. I'll you know, come so and claim. <laughs> <laughs> you can't claim my own because it's me talking. Mm -hmm. um, what was your first... You know, the thing that happened in your heart, not the thing that you said, when Miss first told you that Christ was a made-up story. The thing that you have not said, but you felt it in your heart. Your heart. For me, I wasn't, I was being a journalist, I wasn't being judgmental. Okay. I felt she had the right to religion, she had the right to choose whatever she believed in. Though it hit me, because I'm a Christian, I didn't really try to soak it in because it's what she believes in. So I cannot really impose my belief on her. No, but she used to believe in Christ. Mm -hmm. And all of a sudden she doesn't believe anymore. And you're doing restoration, which kind of sounds... It's, it's Christian. Yes, yeah, so, yeah, Christian. Mm -hmm. So why don't you restore her back to where she was? Because if, you, if, you watch, if you watch the interview, okay. the extensive version, I told her I was going to do the research with her okay. and I was going to prove to her that Jesus existed. And you did that, that was how we ended. And you did that? In the future. Oh, you are here to do yeah. that? Yeah. So right now she's insulting you. You know, are you praying for her? What I, I am. It's, it's rather very unfortunate the turnout of events, but I am just doing what Christ would have done. I've not commented on it, I've not said anything. I'm doing what Christ would have done. Yeah. So I'm just quiet. So what Christ would have done in... In such a case, he would have just kept quiet and prayed for her. So you were saying that you're praying for her? That what, She's have, in what my is prayer. your prayer point? How would you want to know my prayer point? No, actually, it, it is my prayer that Christ would reveal himself. Because she didn't say that she had totally given up. She said if we prove to her mm -hmm. that Christ existed, okay. then she will change her mind. So that is my prayer topic because we all pray every day that people will see the light mm -hmm. as Christians. So she is in my prayer. That is why I don't want to comment on it okay. because as Christians, we are not supposed to fight for people to believe in Christ. It's a matter of faith. It's faith and you don't have to impose it on the person. Mm. So I she she continues to be my prayers. Yeah. And then um um before we leave, I would like to ask you concerning the restoration. Um what's the way forward with it? How will you deal with um new, another uh, um, let's say controversial person that comes on set like that again? How are you going to handle it? Like, because right now, the way it is, I think Miss Bell's management, they've been throwing tantrums, saying this happened, this didn't call me, this, this, this. What, what I've realized is we are all very matured people. Okay. And people have different managements. And managements come in different forms. We yeah. have 
how different management will treat every situation. Yep. If it had been another management, I'm sure it would have been it wouldn't have been as it is now. Yeah. So it's different people. Prophet Osu Bempa came on the show to say he believed or God had showed to him Nana Kufad was going to win the election. Yeah, when the that. media started lashing him, it was controlled at his end. It never even got to us because it was something he had said and he had taken responsibility for it. Yeah. So all the media, all the calls, everything was just at to him. I didn't even come in. Yeah. I didn't even have to come and explain anything. So you're Nanama, to say that maturity should have been into Nanama Mac Brown came to speak about prayer, and she didn't call anybody to defend her or anything. She just went on and on till prayer actually came to write an open letter to apologize. Yeah. So I think we are different people and we handle situations differently. So do you think that restoration is achieving its objective? It is, and even beyond, because restoration is not my copyright it's a copyright of god so god does what he wants to do with restoration god. yes <laughs> all right you can see that this is bringing god into this matter <laughs> <laughs> on, that, on that godly note we would like to say on that godly note yeah, it's been nice meeting, meeting you guys you so much. we've Thank had a lot of the fun best. <laughs> i, I hope, I hope together. Together. only for ghanaians no that's right. Th that is one thing. Um, everybody watching us in Ghana and Nigeria should really watch out because we have some Nollywood celebrities who are coming on the yeah. show. So yeah. Nollywood, Nigeria, and get ready, well. bloggers, bloggers, everybody. <laughs> you know, we so do we normal out. people. Normal we're people. We're not normal people. We're bloggers. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> bloggers. We do Celebrity bloggers. bloggers. Yes. Yeah, me and I have a lot of questions for you now. Eh? I am hmm. going to answer these questions. <laughs> On restoration, I, I not here. Uh, it looks like there is a special spirit in that restoration that makes people say what they don't want to say. No, you come. You come on your own. You come on his own. Don't try to do any collaboration here. No collaboration on restoration. We're looking forward to that. I think we've got. Thank you so much. Shake is ready now. Yeah, we have. Let's. Beat up on it and this a girl This a girl can cool like a cardigan uh -huh. Beat up on it and this a girl This a girl can cool like a cardigan uh -huh. Beat up on it and this a girl This a girl can cool like a cardigan uh -huh. This a girl make a pele like a Peter Pan uh -huh. Me a get a hit like a bawe cardigan uh -huh. This a girl show me love before me love me never see For the winter by me feel like a de hammer uh -huh. This a girl make a pele like a Peter Pan uh -huh. me